All right, we got more cheapskates. Let's get right into it. Do we really need this message? The last girl peed in a bottle and dumpster died for dinner. Like seriously, I don't think anybody's trying this except these people. Now, can you do any better on a price for me? I think that's a pretty good price. People ask me a lot of times, how often do you actually get a discount on something? I don't know, I haven't measured it. Maybe 10% of the time, but I almost always try. What about a nice guy discount? Uh, you know, I'm, I'm a nice guy. <laughs> You look like a nice guy. I don't know if that's gonna work, man. You look like a pedophile to me, so I don't know. And this guy looks like someone that just... just looks like someone I remember. Dude, it's that guy from My Name is Earl. Oh my god, what happened to you, bro? Dude, you're like a star on this hit show. Now you're going to cheap stores looking for a discount? Man, things really went rock bottom, didn't they? Hey, expired products? Yep. Are they free? Yep. All of them? Help yourself. Ah, tomatoes? Making out like a bandit. Hey, expired products, why not? Might as well have diarrhea tomorrow too, why not? Once it's set up and hardened in the refrigerator, uh, you can use it. Oh yeah, that sounds so good. Shit. Yeah, I might be the pedo, I don't know. These are my favorite shorts, I got them for free. I stayed at a hotel, forgot my swim trunks, asked if they had anything and they're lost and found. The woman brought these out, they're just my size. She said, keep them, they're yours. Bro, why would you do that though? Cause you don't know where the other guy's peen has been. It could have been in this guy. I was surprised I was out in the yard with my computer that I could get the neighbor's Wi-Fi signal. So a light bulb came on. I'm thinking, why are we both paying for service if I can pick up their signal from here? Wait, their Wi-Fi goes through their house? My Wi-Fi barely even goes upstairs. And is there any chance you guys would be willing to maybe we'll split the bill and we'll just use your account? Uh, uh. Daddy, chill. Can I stay with you guys? You want to sleep on my couch? <laughs> it's just one night. Okay. Okay, and I, here's the deal. I'm going to cook you guys a special dinner when I get down there. Who wouldn't want to have a guy like me sleep on their couch? Uh, that's a very easy question to answer. Not me. Knowing the Wilson's kids, I thought they'd get a kick out of, instead of buying them something, I maybe made them something. So I went through some of my own trash and I found some interesting things. Martha Stewart, I ain't. I made Celeste, the daughter, a neat little purse out of a plastic milk jug. It's starting to look more like a purse. I'm liking what I see. Sort of in the same theme, I decided I'd make Isaac, the Wilson's son, a nice little billfold out of old bicycle inner tubes, of which I have a lot of. I can't wait to see their faces when they open these presents. The great thing about the gifts I made for the Wilson family was that it didn't cost me a dime. I probably knocked out all the gifts in less than an hour total. All right, seriously, what is that? Nobody's going out with that. That's just an embarrassment, to be honest. Hey, at least you can't get robbed because... The moment the robber sees that, he's turning the other way around. There's nothing for him here. The Wilsons live about 70 miles away, but I'll save on gas because I'm going to ride my bicycle there. Over the course of my lifetime, I've bicycled now almost 95,000 miles. You know, I have something special. I told you I would treat you to dinner. Well, I've got something special here. Oh, my God. Salmon carcass. <laughs> it's a terrific value. I bought them at the seafood market. I don't want to brag, but I only paid three oh, bucks. Wonderful. <laughs> Salmon carcass. Oh, you know you Salmon carcass. Yeah, I got these at the seafood market, two for three dollars, and he threw in two free heads with them. You really can't beat it. I would eat that any day. I'm not even lying. Forget what I said before. Can this guy come over to my house actually now and cook me a meal? I would actually love that. Stacy, where do you keep your trash? It's right under the sink. This is your trash? That's my trash. Holy smokes. Holy smokes, what do you mean is your trash? There's like a dollar worth of trash in here. They're hungry. That's a pretty dish. I would say I spent under ten dollars to make that meal for the Wilsons. Come and get it. It's chowder time. And look at all that meat. There you go. Little little Thanks. treat. Little treat for you. You know the thing is with these carcasses that you have to remember uh -huh. is there's a lot carcass. of fat. Carcass. Can you stop using the word carcass? <laughs> What the hell is that laugh? That's what you guys stop doing, all right? Don't mess with my guy, all right? Stop making fun of him, all right? I freaking love this guy. Boy, we laid waste to that. That was great, thanks. I better thanks. go check on Isaac. <laughs> Damn, they ate the whole thing. They, they low-key like it. Don't even lie, guys. Come on, I would eat that in like five minutes. That looks so good. I brought a few gifts for you. I hope you like it. 
I made it myself. What is this? It's sort of a little oh, purse. Oh. It's made, okay. and it's made out of a one yeah. gallon milk carton. Can okay. you believe it? Oh, wow. Oh. I might use it. My friends might question it a little bit. Let's see, I've got something for you there, Isaac. Hopefully, this will make up for the salmon soup. <laughs> Sorry about the wrapping. It's what I was talking about repurposed yeah. with foil. Save that. What? It's a wallet. It's a wallet, wallet. made out of bicycle inner tubes. Oh, you know what? Oh, wow. I figured, you know, there's nothing a cheapskate hates more than spending good money on some place to keep your money. I'm not sure if I'd use it because it seems really weird rather than like a gift. And I do have a little something for you, Stacy and Tim. I made this myself out of an aluminum can. It's a little candle for the oh, nice. dining room table. Set the yeah. ambiance yeah. for, for dinner. <laughs> well, I think their initial reaction was, this is sort of odd that it's made out of Jeff's trash. Yeah, I mean, a little bit. Like, I can't imagine myself giving someone my trash. Actually, it's not a bad idea. This guy might be onto something. The Wilsons are 25 cents richer. Oh, what a nice guy. He doesn't keep the 25 cents. He gives it to them. He's a pretty good guy compared to the other ones. But anyway, that's the whole episode. He just bikes home 70 miles back. I still don't know how he does that. That's just crazy. But anyway, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.